After another perfect season in the American Conference, it comes as no surprise that head coach Gino Ariema and seven Huskies were honored with conference accolades on Friday, including a sweep of the three major awards, coach, freshman, and player of the year. But for this squad, the goal has always been to win championships. So these individual accolades are just the bonus along the way. You know, it comes with, with how hard we work. And I think that, you know, everyone who, who got an award uh, was deserving of it. You know, we all worked hard. We work hard together and individually. Um, and then we're trying to put together something special. Whoever was coaching these guys this year would have been standing up there with Coach of the Year award. But I'm, I'm happy for our coaching staff and everybody. And um, it, it never gets old, let's put it that way. I think it's incredible. It shows how hard our team really works. And, you know, it's an honor to play at Connecticut and play for Coach and just to, you know, do everything that he wants. You know, it'll it'll pay off in the long run because you'll get your individual accolades. And I think, you know, our team definitely realizes that now. And it's just, you know, it's awesome that, you know, our whole team pretty much wants something. And it's just amazing to be a part of it. I think it shows um, how good of a team we are, you know, when you have basically like your whole starting five, you know, getting an award and you having guys like Stewie winning, you know, player of the year and Kia freshman of the year. I think it just shows how hard we really work and I'm really proud of my teammates. And to be a part of Connecticut basketball, it, it's amazing. You know, you're in there day in and day out and you're working as hard as you can and you're improving every single day in, in little ways. Um, but I definitely think, you know, to be a part of this program and, and with all the accolades that have come to this program was a dream come true. But, you know, being here now and getting through everything has been more than surreal. Real. This is about winning championships, and if you're on a team that wins championships, it's a pretty good chance you're going to get your individual awards. And um, you know, Stewie is the best player, you know, and uh, and we have the best guard. You know, Mariah is the best guard, and Tuck um, may be the second best player. Um, and, and I haven't even gotten a K yet, you know. Uh, so there's a lot of really good players on our team, and uh, they deserve, you know, all the, the recognition that they get. I'm really happy for Stewie. She definitely deserves it. She's been working with CD before practice, you know, 45 minutes early sometimes, just getting an extra work. She really deserves it, and I'm proud of her because she has put in so much time, and it's definitely paying off. My game has matured a lot, and I think that, you know, it's just a feel. You know, I can feel it. It's just, you know, I know that I'm the one on the court who's, who can be there to calm everyone down if, if things kind of hit the fan, that kind of thing, but also lead people with, with my actions. I don't think that you can be a great player unless you have a big ego. Um, how you manage that, I think, is the key. Um, and there is a big difference between being confident and being cocky and being arrogant. Um, and I hope our program and our players never come across as, as arrogant, that we appreciate what we have and, and how we do things and that we know we're pretty good and our players know they're pretty good. But at the same time, um, all we want to do is prove it on the court. We don't have to necessarily you know, go around and beat anybody over the head with it. Um, and I, I think that speaks to their character and who they are and, and what our program stands for. And um, Hopefully, um, other people besides you have noticed it. Now, with the award ceremony behind them, the Huskies are preparing to take the court in the second round of the conference tournament. They'll face Cincinnati on Saturday at 2. Reporting at Mohegan Sun Arena for Huskies All Access, I'm Erica Wachter.